got the Surigaya unboxing here, third box. Uh, snuck another order in like a $50 order because they had free shi shipping again. So I just threw some stuff in my cart and got it. This time we got more Famicom games, but we got a other few odds and ends. Opened a box just to take out the manifesto so my name wasn't on there and doxed myself. I didn't look at anything else, so we'll pull some stuff out. Got some music CDs that were dirt cheap. Uh, for anybody that knows this one, Captain Jack from the Dance Dance Revolution games. I think this was like two bucks. How long has this been sitting here? I like looking at the dates. Man, over a year. Got a Weston Jake Ska Punk CD. This is like two bucks. Wanted to see if it had any import stuff on there. It didn't. Looks like the American release almost. What do we got for the date? Oh, that's been there for like 18. Got a, another Punk Ska album, Duran Duran uh, tribute album. It's got various Ska and Punk bands covering Duran 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 songs. That's been sitting there since. Focus, please. A little bit less than a year. What do we get here? Oh, these are my little tchotchkes. I'll have to open these up and show you like little set Mega Drive stuff. Here, let's put this down and at least show the watch. I don't know if they reseal these. These are like out of those uh, machines, the vending machines. You can get these little tchotchkes in that. But this is pretty sweet here. A little white Sega Saturn watch. I think I gave like four bucks for this. Let's see how this opens up here. See if it's still good. So the only thing that worried about me, these, was uh, changing out the battery if it went dead. Hold on, guys. I got to get two hands so I don't break. Really, look. The eject button on the front. And it looks like it's dead, so we're going to have to try to do a battery to restore in there. What game is in there? Can we tell? Fighting Vipers 2 or something, maybe? Somebody down in the comment section can tell me. That's the only problem. There's no screws on the back, so... Will I be able to change the battery or not? We'll find out. Now for the games. Just got a bunch of cheapings. Get these all out of here. Got a Athletic World. We used to use the Power Pad, but it's known by as the family train. Mm -hmm. there. How long has that been there? So that was since July 27th, so that's about a month old. It's been in inventory. Um, this is either track and field one or two here. I got this. Been in inventory since 21. Of course, you gotta get this. Start nailing these Famicom exclusives down. This is actually better than the second one. Got Goonies one. Oh, that Konami one. Look at that. What is that, 86? Amazing. That's from May. Grab this one because it was cheap. I want to actually start maybe get some high score runs going on it. Uh, there's a Donkey Kong kill screen coming up if anybody wants to watch. 820, so that was an inventory pretty fresh. Nabbed it. A Donkey Kong Terrain. This one was like two bucks. I grabbed it. It doesn't look like too bad of a game. Uh, Lunar Ball, or I think it's Lunar Pool over here. I think I gave 270. I don't know. Really. I have the manifesto. I know it was cheap. It's like I couldn't pass that up for a halfway decent game since June. And last but not least, we got this. I'm gonna have to get the special controller for this eventually. Got Arkanoid One. Because they also have the uh, special dial uh, rotary controller over there. It's way cheaper than uh, the American one, but for Famicom, it's got the special uh, auxiliary plug in the side, so they're not interchangeable. Although they might have an adapter to make it work on Nintendo. But yeah, it's like 20, 25 bucks for the controller. And I'll pop up on the screen what it costs here in America. I know it ain't cheap. I should have bought one years ago at Funko Island. They're like 15 bucks. So I'm going to get the games out. Let's see if we can get the whole spread here. And we'll open these separate. So we got the CDs and that. And I think I spent 46 shipped with uh, free shipping. So I couldn't beat that for what it is. I'd go to the flea market or somewhere, or uh, eBay. They'd be charging like 10 a piece or more on these games, plus shipping. So not bad getting them straight from Tokyo, Japan. 